Hey guys, it's Luke here from 2029C, and I'm joined by... Uh, Kevin, also from 2029C. Yeah, and today we're going to be going over the semifinals 2-1 match between 100A BarkBots against 886W and 10009A. Uh, and in this match, some uh, quite interesting thing, things happened. So Red first took auto here, and then Blue actually started to make up the differential and were in a very good spot to take this match away. And then we'll see how Red actually makes a comeback and makes a last second play to win this match okay, yeah so, starting so off, actually mm -hmm. initially here you see bark Boss actually takes the corner first and they are initially like doing fairly well and blue is down right now um they're kind of at a standstill right now but... yeah i mean we've been seeing bark Boss play the strategy all like all tournament long and especially here uh in elims they've been taking the positive corners right away and just defending their one goal. I mean, they're not they're not playing super aggressively at the start here. And every in any of the matches I see, they're usually always like playing very defensively. And as you can see here, both corners are just uh, is is just a one v one trying to gain, gain control. What do you think about that? Yeah, it's really just about getting those positive corners this game. Just making sure that like you don't give up both of them. But you notice here that eighty six W is starting to go score on their their other mobile goal right now. If Blue does manage to get more rings onto like those three other mobile goals um, yeah that could these be really right bad here. for the red alliance yeah I mean, yeah, especially yeah. since like 100a you see them in like the bottom right corner like they don't have a lot of rings in that goal so like even being in that positive corner it doesn't even it doesn't mm -hmm. do that much mm -hmm. for the red alliance yeah i mean as many of you guys know bark bots did win this whole tournament right but the thing is i feel like a lot of times they were playing a little too defensively and too safe right in a situation like this blue alliance got gained control of like pretty much all the goals but right here Blue Mines been a fatal oh, yeah, mistake right letting yeah, letting Bark Bots uh take their goal away and just plop it into the negative corner here and just and just wait for just wait for the time to count down. And this is what loses them the match here. And the one hundred one that one hundred eight comes in for a last second B score as well and just completely sets that uh sets that like in the coffin. Yeah, like it's important to just keep control of your mobile goals in this game. Like even like even if you have three scored, you have to make sure that the other alliance can't just take it from you and then just put it in a negative corner at the last second yeah like definitely i feel like this is match. a very like unsafe position for that mobile goal to be because i mean we saw in the other matches with uh 1-0-28 right something that really smart that they that i saw they do was that they traded goals very very often very very quickly since they were sister teams they knew exactly how each other played right so then they were able to just transfer the goal to the other team in the corner and one robot will protect two goals and in, in if we have goals in the corner it's a lot harder for the opponents or for your opponents to take them out right instead of having them in the out in the open right here bark bots just comes over and grabs it like very quickly see he's calling that out right here in two seconds he grabs it and he's just off right, right? and then it's over yeah, and so I think we'll see a lot of like play with the negative, like, and especially in the last 10 seconds of the match, like the negative corners will be utilized, especially if you do happen to have any goals that are left exposed, just as the blue alliance did here. Yeah, absolutely. So I think a takeaway for the match, uh, for this match, is to always communicate with your teammates and just make sure you're you're going to be switch, switching those goals out, right? If you if you have control of even one of the positive corners, right, plop your goals in that corner and just make sure you have control over the goals and it's really and just make it hard for the opponents to take them away, right? Yeah. Okay, and I think that's about it for this match. GGs to Barkbots, and yeah. If you guys have any other matches you guys want us to review, put them in the comments down below. And thank you for watching. Thank you, Kevin, for hosting with me.